So today we are going to make a stir fry chicken. So we are now cutting the chicken breast. So we are cutting garlic and we are also preparing to cut shallot. We also have prepared some other ingredients which are onions and was it bell pepper mm -hmm. and chili and tomato and we are pouring oil into the saucepan yeah. so as usual we add garlic and salad first Something to soft salt. Mm -hmm. Soft salt. And now let's use this olive oil. Yeah, olive oil, sorry. This same oil. Add more, more pepper. And let's use it. Now we do have a wooden spatula. Why no. don't you use it? But it's too big. I think this one is more smaller and easier to handle. And the pot is too small, right? So we are going to buy another one? I think so. A big one? I think so. Add more and salt. Is yeah. it just salt or with pepper? Salt and pepper. We are adding chicken now because it needs more time to cook. Yeah, this. because if you don't cook chicken truly, it will you will get salmonella. That's why right. you, you can eat like beef, meat, raw, but not for chicken. Chicken needs to cook like perfectly because the risk of salmonella is really high in this one. So make sure that everything is cooked. So if you have like cooking chicken and still have like a pink center in it, it means that it's undercooked and it means you can risk yourself with salmonella and put your hair and going back to the toilet for many times like that day, it will be worse. So salmonella can cause, uh, can cause diarrhea or stomach problem? Yeah, of course. And you are adding soy sauce. Soy sauce to add like sweetness, sweetness and a little bit uh, color in it. So now you put all yeah. the ingredients yeah. into the okay. saucepan. The last one will be like a tomato. Uh, tomato will be the very yeah. last one. So because you want to make it uh, fresh when it's cooked. Yeah. Okay. It won't be overcooked. Tomato. Yeah. I cut it like a little bit big. So. Why do you cut it big size? Because I think it will be looks better. It will look better? Yeah, and also you can 
sometimes when you eat some stir fry, you, you want to, uh, to feel the texture. Yeah, feel the oh. texture and the freshness of the vegetables, right? Mm -hmm. That's why I add like the bell pepper and the tomato like that. So be crunchy, you know. So crunchy and fresh. Because if the stir fry is too oily, sometimes it's too oily. That's why if you add like some freshness, it will be like a little bit better for me. Uh, you are adding? Yeah, I want to add some truffle oil. What? What is it? Yeah, to add more umami. Okay. And after that, add some sugar to a little bit caramelize uh, and fill up the Wall Street fry. It will be like uh, having like a mixture salt in the side sweetness nice you can see it I think it's almost done so it's done and cooked At least these are the ingredients we still have in our fridge and yeah. we still have something to, to eat today because we haven't done any any more grocery to fill up our fridge yeah and last time it's like a week or two two weeks ago. uh a week. yeah a week ago okay nice yeah i think we need to to go shopping weekly yeah. so this is a stir fry chicken with tomato and onion and ready to serve with white rice so let's enjoy is today 5 or the 5th of September 2019 and my body weight today is 58.4 or 200 grams lighter than yesterday and my body fat percentage is 18.0% so it is really a good progress and I'm happy with the result it's a bit cloudy today so I think it's pretty nice to walk to office because it's not going to be very hot Actually, are they saying sorry? Are they saying sorry to all those drivers or to the pedestrians for this roadworks or sidewalks construction? So guys, today I have another unboxing things. So a couple days ago, my boss asked me to request some pieces to support our work so today those pieces are coming already to our desk so i'm gonna show you an unboxing with you guys so let's check it out so within the parcel from the equipment sections we got this voice recorder we already had recorder actually voice recorder but our last voice recorder is broken and cannot be used anymore so it is replaced by this new one and this one is digital and it is rechargeable by using its USB so it's pretty convenient and also we have I'm gonna show you the main units this one is Microsoft Surface Pro 6 and it's also equipped with this uh, cover keyboard keyboard cover I mean and this stylish pen and also with the office and lastly 
we also requested a laptop which is Dell Dell XPS 13 and also it is equipped with uh, Microsoft Office as well so let's do unboxing and see what's inside how exciting it is so this is how it looks inside the box of the Surface Pro 6 and this one look at that look at that tablet it looks so stunning and inside this pocket we got a keyboard cover it's so hard to open it by using one hand so I'll show you when I open them all so so within the box we get this tablet and we we get this charger charger brick and this uh, power cord and I think it's it's US power cord right Indonesian power cord is not like this and also we got this uh, user guide and also we also have this keyboard cover and don't forget to mention this stylish pen this is the most key feature of this tablet surface pro 6 this is like the most important equipment of this tablet so let's put aside the microsoft surface pro for later because now it's time to unboxing this another cool guy which is Dell XPS 13 so what comes in the box apparently we got another box which is a smaller one and also we got some other accessories this one is charger and this one is the power cord this is Indonesian power cord so we do not need a converter to charge this laptop and also this is a very nice accessories given by Dell to us let's open this well it turns out that it is actually a converter from USB Type-C to the regular USB port I thought it was a converter from USB Type-C to uh, HDMI but it's not so without further ado let's open this smaller box and I believe that the laptop is inside this small box Tara, look at that beautiful laptop look how slim it is and what's inside in the box we also get this start guide yeah, that's it no way look at this look at what we got the office bought us i think the the highest version of dell xps 13 because it has i7 processor 8th generation and this is also the touch screen one and look at this it has dual camera how sick it is i cannot wait to start this laptop and try it so let's start up the laptop wow that's so quick and so beautiful so i'm gonna set up this laptop so it can connect to our office network and and this is the surface pro 6 let's start this very beautiful device well it's also pretty quick oh well, it's so quick now let's see both of them side by side man look at these things look at these two pieces it's like dream comes true although they are not mine but really just looking at these two things these two great things in the world really makes me happy 
It's so pretty. So today I am shopping to filling up our fridge because we already ran out of our food stock and also we are buying chicken and we are planning to cook uh, chicken wings we also run out of eggs chicken eggs so this time i'm gonna buy some eggs